Hello everyone. Welcome to my channel Learn to become an animator. In this video I am going to show you how you can create the camera very easily for any images or any video or any location if you want to create a billboard. You guys can see that I have created a one tutorial for the billboard in the detail in the blender but if you want to just create a camera and mock up like this this kind of example for your any client or testing you can create the camera very easily by using a very small plugin called AppSpy. i just wanted to create for you guys that this is really really good small plugin so you can create very simply camera with the right perspective for any images let's begin first of all you can choose some images for example i have downloaded certain images like uh, this kind of location this is very famous location and uh, we can see the you know billboard has been done for this location if you want to create some 3d or 3d billboard for this location you have to create certain camera with matching the right perspective so that can be done very easily i'm just selecting this one you can just go to google and type this apps file the two things you have to download one is apps file for the windows and one is apps file for the blender so both the thing you have to install it now you can see i have already installed this apps file i'll put the link in the description so you guys can also install it click and open the apps file plugin and load any images here I'm going to load the image which I showed you and let's see how we can create that. So once you load the image into this plugin it will look like this. You can see the X axis and the Y axis okay, and uh, we, we can match it this all. So one thing you have to do is X along with the X axis Y the Y. So let's start with the one. So you can just click on this dot and match with the certain corners to see the detail in the corner if you are not able to see just press shift and you can match it the corner select the other part other corner i am just matching here the straight line you can match exactly with the corner the same way this one red to red here right i am just putting this y axis also here you can see i match all these things but here we can see the x axis is the proper the y is also proper but z is facing down so here you can click and change it to minus y so now everything is perfect to check the our perspective is right or wrong uh, you can go here 3d guide just switch on the box so it will get one you know, box You can click on this dot on a box and you can just place it in the scene. Here you can move it so you can see the these vertical lines are matching perfectly. Okay. That's how uh, we can see that okay our camera will be good. So after checking this, just you have to save the file. Just save or save as save the file here wherever you like it. I'm just uh, typing here and saving that camera press two zero one okay. just save now just go to blender and we have to import this file to the blender you can open the blender just select everything as usual delete yeah, before that you have to install the plugin that add-on apps by for the blender as well so once you install it from here add it and uh, preferences just you have to install 
then go to your downloads wherever you get this uh, apps by blender 1.0.3 and just pull it and switch on so once you do that you will get here import import apps by just import it wherever we save the file camera 001 that's it it will load along with the image and the camera now if you go to the perspective you can see the camera okay and our image as well don't worry about the grid is going up or down that we can manage very easily uh, right now we are just you know looking at the camera as you create the cube you can understand that our perspective is completely matching you can just scale up now you, you can see here you got your 3d space so whatever you want to create inside or import anything right now just i am going to create the usb here after setting up the camera in the blender you can if you are if you have installed the blender kit add-on then you can easily import any object any thing from the blender kit let's see for example i am just dragging okay, this object over blender. yeah let's see this is how we can easily create our big code and, and animate the same camera if you want to get into the maya just very simple thing select the camera from here into the maya and you are working the same project billboard project want to work in the maya and I want the camera just select the camera export it as a fbx in options selected object export. wherever you want just name it i'm just naming as a camera okay. open the maya any version you can use for the maya Now in the Maya, just import the PX. Stop camera import. So here you are getting the camera. If you want to check the camera is right or wrong, you can uh, switch on this uh, safe area action, you know, resolution gate, safe gate, and everything, and you can see the camera. Or you can import the same image here as a image plane so by importing that we can understand that okay it's working yes let's see and here you can do second thing just create a loop and just see camera is perfectly working in the maya as well same way you can create your workspace here also You see in the perspective it will look like this the scene is too very big you can scale it scale down grid 
wherever you want to position the whole thing so this is how very easily you can create the camera for any location hope you understood and uh, like this tutorial very well if you like just share and subscribe if you want to know anything more you can just look into the comment box if you don't understand anything just let me know i can explain thank you so much if you like my tutorial you can subscribe and share thanks a lot